It was authentic. It was, you, you see what you see is what you get. And I want to be like that. I never doubted my dad's love for me. Even when we disagreed, his faith in God and the assurance of heaven were rooted in his confidence that Jesus loved him. John 14, 21 says, He that hath my commandments and keepeth them, he it is that loveth me. And he that loveth me shall be loved by my Father, and I will love him, and I will manifest myself to him. And that's a promise that Jesus made to people that de decided to love God and walk with him. And God, and God loved Dad and manifested his love in his life every day. Always was talking about love. You know, sometimes I would say something that wasn't polite. I'd look at somebody and say something that wasn't right. And my dad would wait a couple seconds and he'd look at me and say, that wasn't very nice. That wasn't the love of Jesus. And I'd say, you're right, Dad. And I, I've seen him do the same thing. You know, he would... He would make a wise crack or something that he knew he probably shouldn't have said. And about five minutes later, he'd say, I shouldn't have said that. That wasn't the love of God. He'd correct himself. And any of you that know him very long, he'd probably have said the same thing to you. <laughs> Dad sees clearly now. If Dad could say one last thing to all of you, his family and friends and church members today, I think he would encourage you to have more faith. Believe the promises of God. Just, you know, believe God can do anything. I know he would want you to have the assurance of heaven and Jesus as your Savior. And he would want to, you to experience God's love in, a way that cha in the same way that changed his life in a whole other way and made him a better person. Today, Dad sees clearly his faith has been made sight. His hope has been rewarded, and his love is now complete. And I think this scripture sums it up. 1 Corinthians 13, 12 through 13. For now we see through a glass darkly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then I shall know even as I am known. And now abideth faith, hope, and love these three but the greatest of these is love the story of my life my dad's life was faith hope and love and that's the way I'll always remember him